Well, guys, this is not your typical rustler. You guys don't believe me? It looks like your normal rustler, right? But it ain't. Don't shoot. One, two. Now, tell me this is your typical rustler made today. This is a Traxxas rustler made in the early 2000s. That's right. How you? And yeah, he actually bought it, got it for free from a from a friend of. Huh? Oh, okay, yeah. We, and he also got the other rustler too, which is. Yeah, oh yeah, that's also a birthday gift for him, so. Seven. You're seven? Yeah. Yeah, okay, that's great. That's what I like about the RC's world, you know? Anyways, so this is a an old school Traxxas rustler made in the early 2000s. And uh, if you compare this one to the Traxxas rustler made today, the major difference is the tires and the chassis. The tires is different. They're usually, it, the, the new Russells have the chrome five spoke rims. And this one doesn't. It had these kind. It had these kind of rims. And also the chassis. New rustlers. New rustler chassis are gray. This one. It's black. No, he did not dye the chassis to black. This is a legitimate rustler made in the early two thousands. And also this is from the gas. Version. Yeah, yeah. This one. You can also tell this one is not your your modern rustler because the modern rustler. XL5 brush systems come with an XL5 ESC. This one is an XL1 ESC. Yeah, that's how old this thing is. We have a 27 megahertz, 2015 BEC receiver, and this is not the original battery, I, I can tell you that. And um, this is not the original connector. This is an EC3 connector that came off uh, out of a Horizon RC car, just like the Torment. I'll show you that in a bit. And uh, this is your uh, what do you call this? Uh, it's Traxxas Stinger motor. If you know, if you know RC, especially Traxxas back in the days, then you would know what this is. This is the Traxxas Stinger motor, and yeah, everything else in this car is pretty much the same thing that you find on the on the new Rustlers. The only difference between this one and the new ones is the the transmission and the hub carriers. Let's start off with the transmission. The transmission uses uses plastic gears. They're not brushless ready compared to the newer ones. So if you want to upgrade this one to brushless, you gotta switch it out to metal gears. And also the hub carriers are not the same one that you find on the new rustlers, stampedes, bandits, and slashes. This one is a, I believe a, no, I actually know it. It's five by eight millimeters, not the five by 11s. So you gotta upgrade those two. If you wanna upgrade these, if you guys wanna upgrade these to bearings, you have to go upgrade to, to bigger uh, hub carriers. So that's the Rustler. Now, for those of you who are ECX or Horizon fans, this is an ECX Torment. And uh, this was not based off the circuit, um, circuit Stadium truck, nor the Boost Buggy. This is based off the Trax, Traxxas, sorry, ECX Ruckus. This is based off an, e uh, an ECX Ruckus chassis which has the high center of gravity just like the tracks to slash and stampede. And this one um, is what you expect on a on a ruckus monster truck. It's um, the high center of gravity and stuff like that. And then the battery's mounted up here. And then there's your ESC. I don't know what model this one is, but I know it's a dynamite. And then there's a servo underneath here. And then the radio receivers are somewhere in here. And then over here, is a Arma aftermarket motor. This, I believe this is a 15 turn. I know stock is a dynamite 20 turn or 15 turn, I believe, I don't know. Not I'm not into ECX, I'm more into Traxxas. Um, but this one has uh, ball bearings, I believe, uh, in the transmission. And I don't know about the gears, I think they're plastic. Yeah, they're plastic, no, okay. So this is the ECX Torment, not really much to talk about. It's, it's basically your straightforward RC car for the, uh, for the newcomers. And I actually driven this car, if you go back to my old videos during the summer. And um, I have a lot of fun with this car. I'm probably going to give it a Doug score after I drive it maybe later today. So we'll see about that. Especially with that one, since that's an old rustler. I want to give a separate Doug score for that one. Both of them are mine. Yeah, and finally, for the RC cars on the shelf is 
this big boy. This is my uncle's HPI Nitro Savage. I did previously previously made a dog score on this one just over the summer. It's a 4.6 big block nitro motor. And it's a lot bigger than the Traxxas 3.3s. And also, finally, um, my cousin wanted to show me some RC cars are in this shelf. As you guys may recall, you probably may know what this is. Just the, there's, there are the controllers, and this right here, up right here, is my uncle's first RC, an HPI Nitro RS4. Still in a work in progress. This right here is the final RC car that my cousin actually, actually the second RC car that my cousin owned. This is an associate, yeah, first, sorry, not second. Anyways, this is a team associated R the RC18T. And yeah, servo's broken, but the car runs though. Everything runs perfectly except the steering yeah. servo. And it's, yeah, pretty darn fast. This one is powered by a Dynamite 8300 uh, KV motor. Brushless motor specifically. You also have like drifting time. Yeah. And then, yeah, this, this thing is, this thing is a monster. Oh, yeah. And those are the RC cars that my cousin owns. He has a vintage Rustler, a new Rustler, which is over there, which is currently gutted out. Another East and two ECX torments. One over there, and then one over there. And my uncle's HPI Nitro Savage. But we're not going to be driving the, the Nitro Savage because it's winter time, and we're not going to be wasting time on, on a, what do you call this, like breaking it in, you know, trying to get it used to the cold weather and stuff like that. We're not going to do that. But we are going to be driving the Torments and that Rustler for sure. And you'll be seeing a Doug score for both of these cars. So in the meantime, Happy Holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and hope you guys stay safe and party hard. Wee!